staffing. They feel like it's a combat zone every day. How many patients? Seven, eight patients. You're running from room to room. Working conditions. We have machines that are just sitting there empty where our nurses are waiting to say what's wrong, uh, what do the diagno diagnostic tests show. A couple of reasons Kaleida workers are on the verge of going on strike. 6,300-1199 SEIU and CW members are working for the largest hospital system in western New York, and they could strike after two contract extensions. We would be thrilled to settle this contract. If there is a strike, Kaleida will be given a 10-day notice. We have the ability to strike at um, all the three hospitals, both nursing homes and the clinic. So um, it would be a very different scenario uh, than it was in Catholic Health. In a statement, the hospital said that the announcement that the unions intend to hold a strike authorization vote doesn't change their goal. They're going to continue to bargain in good faith with the objective of getting a new labor contract without a work stoppage. Everybody needs to come together. Everybody needs to work together. And we need to make this uh, and in the end we will, you know, the finest health care contract in Western New York. We have a lot of new nurses, uh, new graduates who are just, their orientations are cut short. Uh, they are not, they are in an environment uh, where learning has to happen very quickly in order to uh, provide care because we just don't have the staff. Unless an agreement is reached, there's going to be a strike vote September 13th, 14th and 15th. In Buffalo, Claudine Ewing, Channel 2 News.